Well, welcome everyone. Thanks so much for tuning into this tutorial on how to create a podcast. My name is Walter Martinez. Obviously, you know that. Wes is going to be joining me in a future tutorial to be able to explain some more content. But just, just as we begin, I want to have a word of prayer and ask for God's blessing. So let's pray. God in heaven, thanks so much for the technology that we have to be able to broadcast content to as many people as possible. I pray for each one of uh, those watching that they may be able to benefit from this and to um, put the content out there that will most impact the, the most amount of people possible. We love you, Lord, and we thank you again for this privilege. In Jesus' name, amen. Well, I just, uh, in this introduction, I just want to go over two, actually three main things. The first one is that you're going to have to invest in some equipment in order to be able to do a podcast. And the second thing is you're going to need content to actually put out there. So these are the two main things. But the third thing is probably the most important tip that I'm going to give you right here at the outset. And it is that content trumps your equipment. Content is more important than the equipment that you have. Granted, you need good equipment in order to actually get something going. But if you're going to focus on your budget and you're going to focus on spending enough money for the right equipment, um, and you don't have good content, people aren't going to be coming to listen to your, to your podcast. So in a future episode, uh, Wes is going to go over the, how to establish your content, schedule things and set things in play. But I, I want to tell you that from the outset, content trumps your equipment. Now, having said that, let's go back to the beginning and let's go to the equipment. And uh, one of the very first things that you're going to need is obviously a microphone. So I'm going to switch cameras here and just show you a couple of mics uh, that I've played with. And granted, these are more advanced. You're probably going to want to go with like a, a USB microphone. I'll put that in a different tutorial, but I'm just, again, giving you basics. So here we go. So here's the first set of mics. This, these are all Shure microphones, okay? And they're all different. They're all unique. This is called a Shure SM58, okay? Some of you have a mixer or some of you have an interface and you're looking for microphones. I highly recommend the Shure SM58 or the Shure SM85. Both are made for vocalization. And you can get them for less than $100 uh, on eBay, on uh, Facebook Market. This last microphone cost me an arm and a leg. I have two of them, and you'll see them in our videos. Um, I use them a lot. They're called the uh, Shure SM7Bs, and these are monstrosities of microphones. This, this filter comes with the microphone. It's specifically made for speaking, not singing, but speaking. Uh, and so I use it for podcasting. Um, so you'll need microphones, right? But you'll also need an interface. If you're going to use these kinds of microphones, you're going to need an interface. This is the interface that I use. It's called the Mix Pre. You can either go with the Mix Pre uh, or you can go with the Mix Pre M series for musicians. And, and basically what you do is you take your microphone and you plug it in via an XLR cable. So you're going to need an XLR cable. It's the three prong cable. You've got one end that looks like this, one end that looks like this plugs into your interface here, like so. In a future tutorial, I'll show you exactly what goes on. But your interface then takes and um, amplifies the sound or minimizes the sound, and then through a cable, sends it over to your computer, right? So that's um, kind of in a nutshell, the equipment uh, just off the bat. You're gonna need a microphone, and maybe that microphone goes right into your computer, so you're good to go. Or maybe that microphone is more advanced, and so you need an XLR cable, and then you need a, uh, an interface that digitizes your audio and then sends it to the computer. All right, now, what we're gonna provide for you, uh, for those of you, uh, there's, there's only six of us that can get on uh, the, the Oklahoma conference podcast package that we're trying to set up, the hosting side of it. What we're gonna provide for you is the host and the um, making sure that you can put your content online. And um, because there's only so much room, we're only allowing six people to do it. So I'm doing it, uh, Wes is doing it, and uh, Pastor Meng in um, Guymon is doing it, so that's three. So that leaves room for three more people to be able to do this. Now, granted, you don't need to go through the conference. You can pay for a subscription 
and host your own content, which is what most of the pastors are going to have to do. We just wanted to open the doors for people to be able to do it in our conference. So um, that's also part of the necessities of what you need. So you need a microphone, you need a micro, <laughs> you need a microphone, you need a computer, and you're going to need a host. We're providing the host part of it, and these tutorials are teaching you what kind of microphone you might need um, to be able to do this. Now, the software is free. I'll show you that in just a, another episode in just a second. But uh, let me go back to what I was talking about. So the equipment, you need a microphone, you need a computer, and you need internet. But hopefully you already have the computer and internet. And then you also need the content. Okay, so we're good to go there. Great, that's the intro. Now we're gonna move into some more specifics. So I'll see you in the next tutorial.